Hello everyone, Assistant Narrator Richardson here. And I've been thinking, I've never even met a memetic researcher. Come to think about it though, I haven't even met a normal researcher. Which is weird, because I do work at a site for the foundation. Weird. I'm gonna have to ask someone about that. Anyway, let's start, shall we? Item number SCP-6655 Restriction level, level 5, top secret. Containment class, Keter. Disruption class, Eki. Risk class, critical. Archived special containment procedures. Pending. Information regarding SCP-6655 is to be restricted to Site-55, which has undergone new spheric quarantine and placed under lockdown until further notice. Archived description. SCP-6655 is a highly contagious, infohazardous concept discovered by memetics researcher Morgan Riley on the 3rd of the 10th, 2017. While the specifics are still under active research, SCP-6655 is extremely antithetical to conventional human thought. For further details, consult the testing log. Addendum. Archived testing log. Test log 1. Subject. D43724, Project Lead, Researcher Morgan Riley. Procedure, Subject introduced to SCP-6655 infected media and quarantined under standard information sensor practices. Results, within six hours, D43724's communications became a vector for SCP-6655. After 24 hours, Subject's behavior showed major deviations from known personality including decreased empathy, increased proclivity for violent acts, negligible attempts at self-preservation, incomprehensibility. After 48 hours, D43724 was sedated and the test was terminated. Test Log 2, Subject, D43724, Project Lead, Researcher Morgan Riley. Procedure, Subject amnesticized to determine possible countermeasures to SCP-6655 infection. Results, conventional targeted amnestics failed to purge SCP-6655 symptoms from D43724. Likewise, general amnestics capable of removing all memories after SCP-6655 infection also resulted in failure. After extensive testing, a mixture, hence referred to as RMD-6655, of Class D amnestics, Class X amnestics, chlorpromazine and lithium salts was successful in purging SCP-6655 from D43724, although long-term side effects including severe photophobia, difficulty forming new memories, confusion and insomnia, make this impractical as a treatment. The makeup of RMD-6655 can be requested by members of the memetics department. Test Log 3, Subject, Researcher Morgan Riley, Project Lead, Researcher Morgan Riley. Procedure, Impromptu Test, Subject amnesticized to determine possible countermeasures to SCP-6655 infection. Results, Following discovery of SCP-6655 infection during Test 1, Researcher Riley attempted to self-medicate with a mixture of high-grade amnestics, amnestics, and mood-stabilizing lithium salts. Experiment resulted in failure. Test Log 5. Subject, Researcher Martha Smith. Project Lead, Researcher Morgan Riley. Procedure, Subject introduced to SCP-6655 for research purposes. Results, Irrelevant. Classified. Extraneous tests, omitted. Test Log 5, Subject, Senior Researcher Michiko Nakajima, Project Lead, Researcher Morgan Riley, Procedure, see Test Log 5, Results, Irrelevant. Test Log 5, Subject, Senior Researcher Lucy Jones, Project Lead, Researcher Morgan Riley, Procedure, see Test Log 5, Results, Irrelevant. Classified Extraneous Tests, Omitted. Test Log 5, Subject, Site Director Chol Su Kim. Project Lead, Researcher Morgan Riley. Procedure, see Test Log 5. Results, irrelevant. Following the dissolution of the Memetics Department and the recontainment of SCP-6655 by the Foundation 5th Department, 
The above information is deemed irrelevant. Test Log 5, Subject D31255 Project Lead, Executive Site Administrator Chol Su Kim Procedure, Stress Test of Foundation Resources Results, Subject Treated with RMD6655 Causing Immediate State of Panic Subject Vomits and Objects to Test 5 Citing Large Piles of Viscera Inside the Test Chamber and coating the room's walls. The visceral buildup is noted to be far below that required to impede test 5, and as such, testing continues. Testing continues. Approximately 33 hours later, testing concludes due to lack of viable subject. Appropriate decontamination measures undertaken. Test Log 5. Subject, Researcher Morgan Riley. Project Lead. Executive Site Administrator Chol Su Kim Procedure Infliction of RMD6655 to sever connection to SCP-6655 Results Subject displays severe distress at surroundings for unknown reason Proceeding to vomit excessively before fainting Research assistants administer stimulants to resuscitate subject who enters a state of severe panic no further legible information could be gathered, and test was terminated. Subject returned to Foundation employment following re-enlightenment. Test Log 1. Subject, Researcher Morgan Riley, Self. Project Lead, Researcher Morgan Riley. Procedure, Exploration of Long-Term Suffering Potential of RMD-6655 Inflicted Subjects via a Daily Application of Remedy. Results. Subject can barely even look at sunlight anymore. Memories come and go. Subject cannot comprehensively put a mental timeline together. Several notable events are entirely missing. Whether this is due to trauma or RMD-6655 is unknown. Subject cannot sleep. Even if I could, the thought of the dreams make me sick. I need to get out of here. Test Log 2. Morgan Riley. Me. Project Lead, Morgan Riley. Procedure, Attempt to Breach Lockdown of Site 55. Results, There's no way out. Info Quarantine has the site on lockdown, and the elevator into the site's completely caved in. I'm stuck here with Lem. Test Log 5. Subject, D31247. 2. D31254. Project Lead, Executive Site Administrator Chol Su Kim. Procedure, Testing of Procedure 47 Urun. Results, Testing Begins. Subjects familiarized with Procedure 47 Urun, several subjects display extreme distress upon being presented with such. Upon attempting to assault archivist Stephen Hound and escape the research chamber, paralysis induced in subjects 1, 3 and 6 via puncture to the spinal cord to ensure compliance with testing conditions. Subject 1 terminated via strangulation during preparation of procedure. Subjects 2 to 4 terminated via exsanguination during procedure, causing catastrophic failure, mean duration of 63 hours. Subjects 5 to 7 survived full procedure, zero anomalous results recorded. Testing of procedure 48 Urun to begin. Test Log 3 Subject Morgan Riley Me Project Lead Morgan Riley Procedure They don't even read this shit. Results They just test. They just test over and over. There's nothing even left to test. They just continue in the name of testing like a fucked up reflection of a reflection of what was once a Foundation site. There's no life in their eyes. They look like my co-workers. Hell. They can even act like Lem sometimes. That's always the worst part. Lucy laughs in that cute way she always did, but now she's describing the best way to vivisect one of us. There's just something missing. The spark is gone, and trying to hold a conversation with them makes me sick. Test Log 4. Subject, Morgan Riley. Project Lead, Morgan Riley. Procedure. I'm keeping track of time here. Results. I don't know what's in this stuff. I have to take it to stay myself anymore. But it's heavy shit. Whatever it is, they can't tell I'm here anymore. But they're just, 
Liss. Fog. Hours I can't account for. And what I can feels like a haze. When I sleep, I see what I did when I was Lem. I don't sleep anymore. Test log six. Subject. Me. Project lead. Me. Procedure. They're looking for me. Results. It must have been Lucy. I couldn't help it. Seeing her as Lem makes me want to break down. But I just had to see if anything was left. I followed her for several days. I watched as she walked into the bloodline testing wing and carried out acts I heave at the thought of. I watched for the tiniest sliver of hope until I couldn't bear it anymore. I shouted at her, begged her, screamed at her to remember. Herself. Me. Anything. Just a glimmer of her outside what they want her to be. There isn't. And now they know I'm here. Test log 5. Subject. D31256 to D31263. Project lead. Superior 5th researcher Lucy Jones. Procedure. Identification of unenlightened neurological patterns. Results. Subject 1 to 8 administered RMD 6655. Direct neurological investigation of subject 1 fails after subject self termination on research tools. Further subjects restrained. Testing continues. Subjects 2 to 5 expired during processing with negligible practical data. Testing continues. Subject 6 to 8 provided far more valuable data during long term neurological analysis. Experiment concluded after 45 hours due to lack of viable subjects. Isolation of unenlightened neural pathways now feasible. Infrastructure for identification to be implemented. Test log 7. Subject. Me. Project lead. Procedure. They're outside. Results. I've blocked myself in one of their fucked up research rooms. This isn't going to buy me long. Site's still under info quarantine. And I can hear them slamming into the door. It's been days since I've slept and weeks since I've been okay. I'm done. I'm tired. I hear her outside. She's begging me to let her in. It's still her voice, but everything inside it is gone. The care, the laugh, everything is the most disgusting thing I've ever heard, but I can't even bring myself to care anymore. I'm tired. Test Log 5 Subject Her Project Lead Superior 5th Researcher Lucy Jones Procedure Insubordination Results Testing begins Testing continues Testing continues Testing continues. Testing continues. Testing will continue. Uh, that was messed up. Oh, I can't, I can't, what? Knowing that could happen anywhere. I'm not going to trust any researchers from now on. If I meet them, that is. Anyway, I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. Hello, everyone. Creepy Otter here. I just want to say thanks to the amazing author, Limey for writing this document. Honestly, very interesting. I like the structure, I like the way it was presented. I like the idea as well. A load of researchers going mad, just continuously testing and testing and testing. Oof. Anyway, uh, go check them out in the description. For me, uh, go check my Twitter out. It's in the description again. Uh, and check my Patreon out if you want to see videos early. That is also in the description. Anyway, that's it for this one. Goodbye.